Hey viewers, welcome back to my channel. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to uh, do it yourself, a fish strainer. Uh, I'm going to do uh, two types, one with paracord and the other one with the steel wire. Uh, I'm going to use some uh, leftovers, uh, brake lines uh, to do the pick at one end. Uh, this one I'll already uh, cut it to an angle. Uh, it's gonna puncture really well uh, in the, the mouth of uh, the fish. So let's start um, at the other end. This is going to be at one end and you have always like a ring at the, the other end so uh, I'm not going to use any ring. I'm going to make uh, a super 8 nut and that's it. So I'm going to put a bit of uh, shrink. Yeah, this one will be okay. I'm going to cut it in half. So I'm going to put this before. So now you want to do a super 8 nut. Super 8 is easy. You will go over like this. You want to go over it again and get out just like this okay I'll do it again just to make sure you saw it <clears throat> making a turn like this you go under and you go back in the hole and this is the super 8 nut okay so you tight it so this is the loop or whatever the ring you're gonna put back this in here and it will be locked in place just to make sure this won't move here. You can always undo a super 8 nut but I don't want it to be undone. So that's why I have my shrink here. I'm gonna shrink it over this part here so I'm gonna cut the extra here I'm gonna burn this bit here like that. I'm going to put the shrink over it. Okay, you can see that the tip is here. I'm just going to move back a bit and hit this without touching paracord and it's done so this will just never get undone now 
I'm gonna measure about eight feet or ten feet do whatever you need so I measure six feet so hand to hand is six I'll maybe get three three more feet I'm gonna cut that in Now, I'm going to heat this part too. Okay, just like that. Now, uh, I don't remember the, the size of uh, these uh, brake lines but it's just a bit bigger than my uh, 650 pound paracord so it fits perfect in the hole okay wait I think I'm gonna put some shrink when it's there's going to be the junction uh, here just in case this uh, would maybe cut the power cord but just an extra precaution now take the power cord put it into the pick and I'm going to crimp the power cord in just like that I'm going to pinch it three times Just like that, and as you can see, it's not going to move, it's not going to go anywhere. So, now what I want to do is get that shrink inside. Looks like it doesn't want to go. I'm going to shrink it a bit. Just like this. Finally, I'm going to shrink this too. Okay, so so there you go. You have your fish stringer done. So you get this in the mouth of the fish into it and after you just do this and this will get your fish attached to your stringer and it won't go anywhere so this is first version now we're going to do the other one Okay, so now uh, using another uh, brake line tube again. Gonna 
make it flat and cut it to an angle just like that this is the uh, steel braid wire as you can see it's a bit too small but I think it's going to be okay anyway it's just to puncture the mouth of the fish once again so I'm going to crimp this three times again there you go won't go anywhere now the other end making a loop there's obviously uh, different ways to do a loop uh, I'm gonna use uh, brake lines again and crimp it just like this okay now uh, making the loop uh, with the steel wire I'm gonna use again uh, a piece of uh, brake line go into the wire first making a loop you want to go back into that brake line push just like that now you have your loop just need to crimp it it's going to be the same way just like uh, the other one getting them out of the fish and after tread like that and your fish will be on your uh, fish stringer simple as that okay so now I'm going to crimp this This will never go anywhere. So, just like this, fish will be trapped in. Just like this. So, just use your imagination when you can do it. It's always fun doing your stuff yourself. So I got myself two fish stringers in about, what, five, ten minutes not more than that and uh, it's as good as uh, <clears throat> a big brand name so if you like what you saw give it a thumbs up leave a comment down there below and of course uh, 
Don't forget to subscribe and thanks for watching.